Hey guys, what's going on? Lyrical Persuasion here, and today I'm bringing you a bag full of goodies. Um, a Best Buy pickup. I apologize if you couldn't hear me. As you can see right here, I have a bag full of goodies from Best Buy. And I'll tell you guys this before, um, Best Buy is like one of my favorite stores to shop to, shop at. So, yeah, that's, that's basically it. But if you guys like this video, or like the pickups, or whatever, you want to see more pickups of me going to like, I don't know, Best Buy or Target or Walmart going into the movie bin. I pick up a couple movies and bring it home. Let me know in the comment section below or by simply liking the video. And, you know, we can get into that. But the first thing that we got right here is Madden 13 on the PS Vita. There's a front and the back. I'm not doing the unboxing. I'm just letting you guys see what I got. Apologize. My nails are probably looking kind of rough. So that's it right there. And I got my camera set up on the tripod my mom got gave me like a long time ago, but I never used. And I actually like it because now I don't have to hold the camera. I can actually use two hands if I want to unbox. And we got the Walking Dead bundle of the PlayStation Vita right here. As you guys can see, can you see that? The 3G Wi-Fi. They had this on sale at Best Buy for $200 or $199.99, something like that. So basically, you could say $200. So I was like, all right, you know what? I'm going to go ahead and get one. So here we go. I mean, I wanted it for like the whole aspect of, let me show you guys the back. The, um, oh wait. Yeah, the aspect of, they said that the next gen consoles, you can use the PlayStation Vita to work with the PlayStation 4. And as you most of you guys know that I'm getting the PlayStation 4. And my sister, she's getting the Xbox One. So we're going to be basically having the, both the same consoles. We're both going to have, I don't know, I can't speak. We're going to have, there's going to be two next gen consoles in this house next month. In November she'll have the Xbox one I'll have the PlayStation 4 whenever she wants to play my PlayStation 4 she can play it vice versa so that's how we normally do it normally I would have had got the Xbox first that's what I started with the Xbox 360 first I got that in like 2008 um, late 2008 and then I got Xbox Live Gold in 2009 like in February 2009 and so you know I've been an Xbox Live membership I have a, it's not gold now but I've had Xbox since basically 2008 so that's like a long ass time almost five years um, but yeah, so you know, I don't want to hear about my gaming history, but like I said on the back, it says a rich world of portable gaming awaits. You get a total of, I don't know if you can see this because it's kind of weird because I kind of look over at the camera, make sure you guys can see it. Access over 650 games available for purchase on PlayStation Network, and that's the back. I'm pretty sure you guys have already seen the unboxing of the PlayStation Vita. Like I said in this video, I won't be unboxing it, I will just be simply showing you guys what's in my bag. So that's the PlayStation Vita. We'll go ahead and put that behind. <sighs> So we don't get in the way. Alright, and then we got the PlayStation Vita uh, starter kit right here. As you guys can see, I got the. it comes with the PlayStation Vita play case. And then it has the little places you can hold the Vita in. And then it has, you know, where you can put the games and two memory slots. And then I also got a 4 gigabyte memory chip that came with it. And then in my PlayStation Vita, I got another 4 gigabyte um, memory chip with it. So I got a total of 8 gigabytes. I know you guys are probably, oh my gosh, you know how to do math. Yes, I know how to do math. Um, and so this is the back here. Like I said, you probably don't care about it, but that's the PlayStation uh, starter kit. If you guys know of anything that's um, better, let me know. And then I got another one. I got two because you'll see in a second. But that's the front and the back. <clears throat> and then we have another PlayStation Vita The Walking Dead bundle 3G Wi-Fi with a 4 gigabyte memory stick and then it's not the actual Walking Dead game you get the um, game voucher and the memory card I didn't show you that in the last part of the well my first PS Vita thing and then you know there's the side there and then the back there and then the side here with the serial number and all that kind of stuff but yeah so this PlayStation Vita um, is for my mom because, well, she actually, we went and got her another PSP, in which I still have my PSP. I'll show you that probably in the unboxing of the PS Vita. But, um, yeah, so she she was like, well, Leslie, you can get me a PlayStation Vita, too. And I was like, all right, Mom, go ahead and get it. So I got two. And this is, I guess she wants this as her early Christmas present or whatever. Even though I'm going to get her something else uh, for Christmas, I'll probably get find see if they have any Vita uh, movies. Like, you know, like back on the PSP days, how... You can go out and you can buy uh, PlayStation 
PlayStation Portable movies. Like, I have a couple of movies over there, over there by my gaming. I can show you guys that, too, when I do my PS Vita unboxing and, like, the review of the Vita and all that kind of stuff. You guys can see that. But, yeah, they used to sell the little movies on it, and I can get her those uh, for Christmas and all that kind of stuff. And also, like I said, today is the 8th of October, so that means that... Ah, that's right. The Purge! The Purge! Now, I never went to go see this in theaters, but I wanted to check it out because I thought it was so cool. The fact that, you know, once a year you can go and crime is legal. You can kill as many people as you want to. Um, the crime rate is low, you know, because people don't do it throughout the year. Like, you only get once a year that, you know, you get to actually kill people. So I was like, oh, man, that's kind of cool. So I wanted to check that out. So here's the front and the back of this. I'm going to do an unboxing of this and let you guys see or whatever. But I just basically, like I said, I just want to show you guys um, what's in my bag. And then we got a couple more stuff in here. Let's see. Then I got MLB 13 to show. So shouts out to Home P. Now that I got MLB 13 to show, we can easily definitely play against each other. Because I, I think you still have this game. Because I remember a while back, you know, when the MLB 13 show came out on PS3, you said that you had this. And I think you did an unboxing. I'm not too sure. But I got this game on the PlayStation Vita. So if you want to play... We can play because it's a lot easier than doing it on the console. I don't have to get up and turn my PS3 on. I can just lay in my bed and I can play you in baseball. And this goes for anybody else. I think this is cross-platform. So if you don't have the PlayStation Vita, you can play me on the PS3 or whatever. And just let me know. I haven't set up a PSN yet, obviously, because I'm just showing you what's in my bag. And we're going on six minutes. So I don't want to make this too long. That's why I didn't want to do an unboxing. But all right, this is the last two things that are in here. And that's some PlayStation Network cards. I wasn't going to buy what we got two because one's for me and one's for my mom. Because they said that you get like two or three games for the Vita. So I was like, all right, cool, man. I'll go ahead and uh, get a PlayStation Plus. It's the first time I ever had a PlayStation Plus. And like I said, there's both of them. So I was at first I was kind of hesitant about getting it because I was like, the next gen consoles come out next month. And I don't know if it's going to actually let me, you know, use this membership to go to my PlayStation 4. But then I was like, well, I still have it on the PlayStation 3, you know, on both consoles. Because I'll probably play the PlayStation 3 for certain games. You know, if there's a used game out there and I want to play it. And I haven't, you know, I got a couple extra dollars to save or saved up. And I just go ahead out and get the used game or whatever for PS3. And then I can just play it. Or can I still get games on my PlayStation 3 as well as my PlayStation 4? So that's why I was kind of like, I don't know if they'll do that or not. But I will definitely um, move my PlayStation name to the PS4 so I can actually access this. So I can get games and, you know, have PlayStation uh, Plus. Because in order to play online on the PlayStation 4, you have to have PlayStation Plus. So I just went ahead and got this. And this was $49 for a year. So that's basically what's all in my bag. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to leave a like, comment. And subscribe and go ahead and put these stuff back in the bag. So yeah, so don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Sorry, my game just fell up in there. And like I said, um, if you want to see more of these, like unboxings or pickups, let me know in the comment section below and I will do some more uh, pickups for you guys. And, you know, like I said, it can be movies because I love movies. And sometimes I go to Walmart and I go into their $5 bin and I can find different movies. Like, what did I get out of their $5 bin not too long ago? I think I got, well, no, not the Batman. The Batman was actually 12 bucks for four Batman movies and I love Batman. I'll probably make a video on my movie collection it's not that big it's starting to get bigger because i'm starting to go out and buy movies like this um not just blu-ray but dvd stuff also and so i'm trying to get that bigger i can probably make a video of that and then i can show you guys my gaming collection like my personal gaming collection not the ones of my old school games or anything like that um right now we're about to go on <laughs> nine minutes so i'm about to go ahead and cut this video short so like i said if you guys enjoyed the video don't forget to leave a like, comment, and subscribe, and I will talk to you guys later. And don't worry about my freaking blue sweatpants. I love blue, though. But anyways, hopefully you guys enjoy it, and I'll talk to you guys soon. And I don't know when I'll be uploading the unboxing for the other two yet, or this video for that matter. You're probably not even watching it on Tuesday, of course. You're probably watching it on Friday or Saturday. I don't know when because I've been so busy with school, so I got a test on Friday. Hopefully I pass it. And, you know, after that, then everything will probably go back to normal, me doing uploading of videos and different things like that. Um, so just be on the lookout for that. And thanks again for watching, and I'll talk to you guys soon. Later, everyone.